Hey guys, in this game you will see how important map awareness really is and if you master this skill, you can bring your gameplay to an even higher level. If you want to dominate with heroes such as Hanzo, you will need really good map awareness because most of the time they will be hunting for your body while you are ulting and you will see that very often in this match. the enemy reaches the battlefield. Smash them! All troops deployed! The enemy has Franco, but that doesn't bother me a single bit, because I can just eat the buff. It's a gift. Do right enemies. This Daru wants to disrupt my early farm, because he probably knows that Hanzo is completely useless at this stage of the game. And luckily for him, our Ruby was AFK for the first minion wave, so he's not losing the golden experience in the bottom lane. I cannot continue farming bot, because the enemies are all gathered there. When the unexpected happens, you just gotta adapt to the situation and play a bit differently. All of this is to make myself. Launch attack! I still have full HP. So I will try to block Granger's ult. Initiate retreat. That prediction from Franco though. Become even stronger. Let's try to kill Dyro first. And if we are successful, then we can take the turtle. Initiate retreat. You have slain an enemy. Unfortunately, I had to use retribution to get a kill. But maybe we can try to kill them while they are attacking the turtle. We just killed Dyrov. Now we have the bottom lane open to gain the maximum amount of gold from the turret shield. You always want to play as efficiently as possible, especially when you are the jungler. How my second skill didn't reveal Leslie here. Becoming a part of me is a kill. Three by Golly Franco. In the meantime, we are losing quite a bit in all the other lanes. Just the way I hope. The 
We are all bunched in the middle lane. We shall be defending the silence instead. Why does it feel like every time we get one kill, we lose many more? How interesting. Let's replay what just happened. Oh, now it makes sense. 100% our fault, somebody got hooked right away. My apology. Ally has been slain. I will be stronger. An enemy has been slain. Request backup. I'm in over. Ping attack whenever you're ready to gank, it helps your teammates know what you're about to do. The Oof, this lessy got the move. Our turret is under attack! All of this is to make myself stronger. Remember that you can always use the ult to escape. An ally has been slain. Clear up lanes. Keep clearing the lanes and never stop farming. No matter how bad the situation might be, as long as Hanzo gets his core items, he can easily kill the enemy's backline. Leslie is easier to kill than Dyrov, so I will make sure my first kill hits her. I don't care about their tank here, my targets are the DPS. I keep thinking that she wants to retreat towards her turret, and I'm trying to predict her movement, but I guess she really wants to put up a fight. Remember to use the ult to destroy the objectives a lot faster. I wanna go for the marksman. But Darif will attack my body. I have no choice but to bail. Even during the fight, I'm paying attention to the map, and here you can see Granger is attacking my body.
I'm waiting for my ult and then I can help top. Once again, somebody is going after my body. I got a recall right away. This is the only way out of here. Pretty sure Xavier is the one who wants to surrender. The person who has been crying non-stop since the start of the game. It seems like they don't want to risk taking the Lord without their jungler. I will not use my first skill until Odette uses her ult so I can interrupt it with it. I'm gonna ignore their heroes and just focus on the inhibitor. We don't have minions yet, so I'm gonna wait until they're inside their base to use my ult. Some days my map awareness is not working that well, but I realized that if you tell yourself before the match that you will pay the utmost attention to the map, then you will most likely be conscious about it throughout the entire game and play so much better. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video and if you did, consider leaving a like and subscribing.